The play clock's running down. Kaepernick's back in shotgun formation. Walk with the sack. Well, this is about as bad as it gets for a quarterback in a situation like this. You're near the goal line, and they give you a chance to throw the football, and you take a sack. Oh, my gosh. I would want to be him in that film session tomorrow. Quarters formation here for the defense. Third and forever. And it's Antonio Cromartie with the pick. And Williams is the one who brings him to the ground with the lead and their defense making plays like that. This is shaping up the... ...positive second quarter. And... on both sides of the ball and you know when you're in a situation like this be aggressive go for the score as quick as you can on the offensive side what a difficult spot to be in from here will go ground still on his feet breaks free going to take it the distance the 40 the 30, the 20, the 10. Nobody was going to catch him there. Touchdown. To me, still one of the most exciting plays in NFL football. A long running play for a touchdown. And how about that when it had it all in its speed? Good moves, good blocks. The Saints come out with a split backfield. First down at the 18. Kaepernick now on the move. Finds his mark. And they bring him down at the 33-yard line. First down and 10. And it's just thrown away. Failing to complete that one. So second down here. We're moving in on the two-minute warning. One more snap first. Kaepernick's got it in the gun. the two-minute warning. The offense coming to the line inside the opponent's 20. This play set up by the long gainer. And Kaepernick, touchdown, and that'll close the gap in this one. If the defense is not going to play for the quarterback sneak, then make them pay for it. Take advantage of it. That's what the offense did. The quarterback took advantage. The Saints getting ready to kick it away. Sanders is running this one out. And they stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. The Jaguars really have this offense cranking, Phil. They've scored on their last two series. You know, what we see now in the NFL, so many different ways to move an offense. Screens, one plays, power plays, trick plays. Right now, everything working on the offensive side. McCoy takes down the quarterback. Ah, not a good job by the quarterback that time. Inside of two minutes in the first half, you got to get rid of the football. Nobody's open, just throw it away. That time, he loses yards by taking the sack. Second down coming up. Okay. 
Jackson's out there to receive the screen pass. Woodson's in on the tackle. Kid this time, it's a halfback screen. Nice job by the quarterback. The halfback, good job after catching it, picked up some good yards. Brady's three for three with that completion. First and ten. Alden Smith with the quarterback takedown. Got to give the defense a lot of credit here. You want to stop the offense from scoring here with under two minutes to go in the first half. Good pressure on the quarterback, and they take him down behind the line of scrimmage. Loss of four on the play. Second and 14 after the set. Doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. But they can't connect. Well, it's third long. I just say this be very careful on the offensive side. Third down on the way. Jackson's lined up in a single back formation. It's Brady down the field. Makes the catch. Touchdown. Getting close to the half, and they're giving their opponents a lot to talk about in the locker room. Yeah, they are putting some kind of whipping on them here early in the game. I'll just say this for the defensive side that's losing. It's been terrible. So go in there at halftime, change what you're doing, and get back in this game. Peterson will just settle for the fair catch this time. The Saints taking the field on offense, coming up a touchdown on their last drive, Phil. Yeah, they did it most... Through the air, Tim, and I love the way how they did that. It was aggressive throwing by the quarterback, and my gosh, is he on target today? It's a two tight end formation. Got a flag down here, and he knocks the ball out of his hands. Defense was trying to guess the snap count, and it cost them there. So many times when you drop a football in the NFL, a pass like that, it's because of lack of concentration. You're just not serious about what you're doing. The Saints are at the line of scrimmage with a pair of backs split behind the quarterback. There's a flag out. Bob Miller gets to the quarterback. That's what happens when you try to guess the snap count. It is truly a bonus when you can take your outside linebacker and let him rush the quarterback and he can get a sack. Nice job that time by the outside linebacker. First down at the 30. Kaepernick, and they swap him again. That's an excellent job by the defense. Just gets quick penetration in there. Hits the quarterback and gets the sack. That clock keeps moving. What a job by the defense in this situation. Take it down and sack again. Outside linebackers who can get to the quarterback. They are a rare breed in the NFL because it takes talent, size, speed, everything to do it as a linebacker. And we saw it that time on display. Kaepernick standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. But it falls incomplete. And that will close out the first half from Western New York.
And we'll take a short break for halftime before returning for the third quarter. All right, Larry, thanks a lot. Second half just about to get underway here as the special teams are about to head back onto the field. Kaepernick will lead his offense back onto the field here as this goes for a touchback. The Saints talk things over at the intermission, and I'm sure one of the first orders of business was to try to figure out a way to get this offense going, Phil. Absolutely. That's what you want to do, and I think you do that by play call. So the coach, they have many plays that we call drive starters. Catch the defense by surprise. They need to call one of those right here and right now to get this offense going. Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. Second down and ten. Catch made. And that's Cromarty in on the stop. The Saints, that time, they can't get big yards, but the throw and catch picks up a few, and his third down's much easier with this situation. Kaepernick's completion percentage, 70% on the day. They connect on that pass play, but it's still third down. The Saints get set at the line, meaning to get to the 30 for a first. Kaepernick from the gun. Got the completion. Well, when you're down a couple of scores in the second half, you're just looking for some positives and trying to get some momentum on your side. So that first down by the offense, maybe that'll give them some confidence, and we'll see where they can go with it from here. Kaepernick's alone in the backfield. First down at the 32. Got the completion. Now they take the football onto the opponent side of the field. They hurry to the line of scrimmage. Colin Kaepernick from the shotgun. He's drilled as he throws. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. The Saints at the line of scrimmage, split backfield. Kaepernick takes it from the gun, makes the catch. That's a gain of six. It'll be third down. The Saints do a really good job this time on offense. The quarterback throws the ball short. They pick up a few yards, and now it makes third down much easier. Has his man. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. They have tried to figure out a way to take the running back out of the passing game, but he continues to be targeted and delivering yardage. It's really simple. The linebackers, the guys trying to cover this running back, you just got to admit it, Jim, they are not fast enough to get it done. Reaches out and snatches it. Sims is marked down after a gain of nine. They're in the hurry-up mode. Second and one. Pulls it in. Taylor's there to make the tackle. The best way to keep the other offense uh, on the sidelines is just keep marching down the field and picking up those first downs. What a good job by the offense. Kaepernick's now completed four in a row. Has his target. If I'm on the defense and the offense is this close to scoring, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I am going to gamble that it is a run. If they have the courage to throw it, let them. If they do, of course, it'll be a touchdown. Second and goal at the two. Catch made. Sims is brought down after picking up only a yard. The Saints are giving ground, but if they can make a stop here inside the 10, it'll be interesting to see what happens on fourth down. Yeah, but listen, the offense has to find a way to score on this play here, get it in the end zone, and get back into this football game. Who are they going to give it to, running back, or are they going to try and trick the defense and throw the football?
The offense back out of the field here for this fourth and short play. Touchdown, and they cut into that lead. That time on fourth and goal, the offense goes for it. The defense is all excited. They want to try to stop them, and they make bad mistakes and give up the touchdown. It's good. The Jaguars are back deep, ready to return the kickoff. Sanders is going to run this one out. And he runs it out to about the 27 before he's taken down. The Jaguars come out for the next possession, having reached the end zone on each of their two previous drives. Yeah, it's been good stuff to watch, no doubt. You know, the offensive side, the offensive coordinator is right in tune with the quarterback. They're calling exactly the plays that they need to be called because of the situations, and the quarterback has been hot throwing the football. Brady, handoff. Tackle made by Smith that time. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. The Jaguars have the football as the fourth quarter gets started. Second down here. Here is the first snap of the final quarter. Woodson's there to make the tackle. Hard to get these plays nowadays in the NFL. Second and short, the defense sails out because they are expecting run. Well, to run that time by the offense and know where to go. Third down and two. The Jaguars get a first down. Third catch today so far. The Jaguars' offense has been tough today. They are fighting out there on the field. That's a nice job picking up that first down. It's been fun to watch. They got a small lead here in the second half. We'll see if that first down can lead them to a score. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Woodson's there that time for the tackle. When you're leading the game in the fourth quarter and you're on offense, you are looking to use the time up on the clock. So that was a nice play call by the offense to run. Defense stops it for a short game. Now. The Jaguars will take the snap from the 45. Dez Bryant with the catch. And he's in for the touchdown. What a play. What a run. You never know with the talent of these guys nowadays. Little short passes. You think they're harmless. And look what happens. They got so much talent all the way down the field for the score. The Saints getting set to return the kickoff. Peterson's not going to test the coverage here as he makes the fair catch. The Saints heading back onto the field on offense. They scored on their last drive, Phil, and they did it with a blistering aerial attack. Quarterback is hot. He is getting protected. Oh, man, what do you do now? I think if you're an offensive coordinator, it doesn't matter what you call. You know your guys are going to make it work. The Saints approach the line, and they're going with their jumbo package. First down at the 20. Locked in on the football and has hold of it with two hands. The Saints did a good job there on first down. That pass picks up some good solid yards. Now second and short. Much easier to call those kind of plays. Playing press coverage to the outside. The Saints line up. Split backfield. The Saints from the 27. Kaepernick now on the move. Needs to get rid of it. Kaepernick's athletic enough to get out of the pocket. That's a really good job by him. But you have to give the defense a lot of credit. They shut down all the receivers. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Third down and three. Brings it into his body. The Saints have used the running back as an all-purpose threat today. Sims has had to be a target in the passing game multiple times, and he's flourished in that role. He sure has. Running backs love catching the football in open spaces. Nothing like it. Not like running the football where everybody's trying to hit you down. They catch it, not as many people around them, and they can make those big plays. Second down coming up. Time, obviously, a factor the rest of the way.
Kaepernick's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Unable to bring it in. You got to try to avoid this as a quarterback. Don't throw off that back foot unless you have to. When you do, there's just no way you're going to be as good if you had good balance. That time the throws off the mark. Kaepernick from the gun. Kaepernick's on the move. Reggie Wayne makes the catch. They bring back out the offense to go for it. Crucial play here. Fourth down on the way. The Saints take it from the 28. With two hands, he has it. The Jaguars' offense doesn't want to do anything to screw this one up at this point, Phil. They've got the lead, and they've got the football late in the game. Ah, wow, you're such a positive guy, Jim. I like that comment. Go down there and tell them that. Don't screw it up. But what do you do in a situation like this? I always like to try to draw the defense off sides on first down because they're anxious, and you can take advantage of that. Quarters formation here for the defense. And off out of the eye. Justin Tuck in on the tackle. Well, we know you can win the game, but just running the football, then you just run the football. Take no chances. Keep two hands around it at all times, and don't worry about the extra yard. Dez Bryant on the receiving end. Time continues to tick away as they'll rush back to the line. Now he's going to change the play. Look out. I think he's going to go down the field with the football. And he comes down. No. The defender tips it out. Well, Phil, I enjoyed watching the game with you. And how about a final thought about that?